everyone, it's Hispanic Heritage Month and we're celebrating with some great books that we have in our diverse collection. Now growing up, I didn't have a lot of characters that looked like me or shared my culture and I'm happy to say that's no longer the case. There's so many books in the children's area that celebrates Hispanic heritage and Latinx culture and I'm just going to share a few of those with you today. You may be familiar with Stone Soup, but let me introduce you to Empanadas for Everyone. This is a story about a young girl, Karina, who goes around her diverse community to gather ingredients to make empanadas for her tia. It's a great book that shows compassion and community building. If you like The Last Stop on Market Street, try Koki in the city. It's about a young boy who moves from Puerto Rico to New York, and while he still misses his home, he falls in love with the community he finds in New York. If you enjoyed the graphic novel, Smile, about the struggles of having braces, try reading Four Eyes. It highlights the struggles that you can feel when you show up to school wearing glasses. If you like fantasy stories where the princess saves the day, like in sh books by Shannon Hill or Gail Carson Levine, you should try Solimar, the Sword of the Monarchs. In this story, Princess Solimar saves her entire kingdom and of course, the butterflies. If you like Casper the Friendly Ghost, you should try Gustavo the Shy Ghost. It's a story about Gustavo finding friends in his monster community. Go out and share these Hispanic and Latinx stories with your young ones, but stick around because we'll have some great Latinx and Hispanic stories to share for young adults and for adults.